Today is family adventure day, which means we're gonna go hiking and do some snacks and have a fun family day. But we're also gonna stop first and look at a house that has an open house today that Dan and I think might work well for our family. Twins are sleeping. Hi, Care or Chloe, and Karis is sleeping. So I'm going to go in with the, uh, three older kids, and Dan is going to stay out here with the younger twins can so they can over? keep sleeping. Uh -uh. And with Toby. <laughs> Hi, Toby. I think we could fit our dining room table because it would probably come out to like right about here. Do you think? Because we got to fit. Let's see, eight people around it plus guests. So I think that would fit. Because it would basically make this whole room be the dining room, basically, kind of, which would work well. Heading upstairs, nice little foyer entry, huh? Here's one bedroom. Oh, that's nice. So don't touch any of their Legos. Those are cool, but don't touch any, okay? We're just looking right now. Let's look outside, see what, it looks, what the backyard looks like. Oh, cool. A fireplace. Nice deck. Isn't that cool? And then they got a little, like, a treehouse kind of thing out there. And then on the other side is a creek, which would be really fun to play on, wouldn't it? Hey, in the summer, to go oh, creek stomping. A house. They have a birdhouse out there? Oh yeah, they do. Here's the master bedroom. Dad? Ooh, look at a nice bathroom. This would be for mommy and daddy. Okay. <laughs> look how small that is. That looks cool, huh? I bet we would let you guys take baths in there, though. Wouldn't that be nice of us? <laughs> Dana would love having the washer and dryer up on the second floor. So then the then the the um the laundry doesn't even have to go downstairs. It can just stay upstairs. Whoa, just go right from there to there. That's cool. <laughs> What's in there? You see anything, Allie? No. Another bedroom. Oh, look. yeah, Allie, don't jump. This not. This isn't our. These aren't our toys. Okay. All the kids have Xboxes in this house. That's pretty cool. I think. <laughs> Bunk beds. Yeah, kinda. Hmm. Living room is nice. Nice living room. A nice look out on the porch. And the kitchen is wonderful. That's a big enough kitchen for us to cook. I just don't think we'd be able to put a table right here big enough for us. We pretty much just have to use the dining room, I think. Yeah. The basement is unfinished. And there's a rough-in for a bathroom. So I'm guessing this would have to be where I would work. Or we'd have to finish it up and then I would have an office down here. Mostly storage, it looks like. It's kind of like we're going for a hike early today because in the backyard you go down to this creek which would be super cool. Wouldn't that be fun to have behind our house? It's pretty steep though. <laughs> yeah, you can hold on to the rope when you go down and then that's the house right there. One thing's for sure, if we buy this house, we would need to build stairs. <laughs> it's really slippery to get through. We have to put some stairs in. But once you get down here, it's actually really nice because this would be like the perfect creek stomping place for kids and stuff look there's like that there's a um it's all like flat rock it goes all the way out here and there's flat rock there so you could easily put some chairs up on the water right there and then just let the kids play in front of you and it's nice and flat it's not too deep but the water is still moving so it stays clean so it's like a perfect little spot right here all right let's go back up and let mommy look at the house we're on our hike. We made it out to the nature woods for a hike in <laughs> the nature woods. What we've been doing, as you guys saw a couple weeks ago, we did a hike, but it was on like a paved path. I was like, eh, not quite the same. Daddy, it, Daddy, look! There's a tree. Oh yeah, it's a dead tree there. And there's a creek down here, hopefully we'll go get to look at. Just like, I think this might be the same creek that goes behind the house we were just looking at too. But it's, mo it's way more nicer when you get to hike when there is a, uh, nature and trees around rather than like on a path a paved path in the middle of a field you know this is gonna be a good hill for exercise on the way home when we have to go back up it doesn't it he thinks he sees an alligator alligators what let's go look at the alligator <laughs> what's wrong hallie the alligator's gonna snap your finger uh, i think it's probably a pretend alligator I don't think it's a real alligator. No, I don't think it's gonna snap your hand. <laughs> You'll be fine. Yeah. That's the alligator? Yeah. Oh, are you petting it? Where is its mouth? Is that the mouth, Hal? Is it gonna bite your hand off? No, it's a silly pretend alligator. 
For those of you guys who are newer around our our vlog, our family, what we do on weekends is we do Family Adventure Day, which is a time for us to get out, do something together as a family that's fun, to connect with each other, build relationships with each other, to make memories together. And often Dan and I try to tie in something that's like a lesson or something that uh, we can teach our kids. We don't really have that here today, but we're all we are always just kind of keeping an eye out for What's a good teaching Whoa! moment? What's a good opportunity we can use to Mommy, teach our kids something? Tree, yeah, that's a big tree <laughs> I bet that made a little big loud crash when it fell, huh? We could, we could it. Yeah, let's not <laughs> Let's just keep on the path and go down to the creek and So then I just keep our eye out for teaching opportunities like we do like normal But especially when we're out doing fun family things together and uh, just to make memories and get to know each other better. How are the twins doing? They are sleeping they're, like pants on they're the both, ride. Yeah, all this bouncing and bumping, putting you girls to sleep, huh? That's the best way to get a nap. Yeah, seriously. <laughs> Stay nice and relaxed and everything. When they get bigger, they get to push us on our bumps. Yeah, in our wheelchairs. <laughs> and then they can push us around. Are we at a dead end? How do we get across? Step on the rocks? Yeah. Alright, go ahead. Careful not to fall in. You can get across. Yeah. Those wheels will be fine. <laughs> go ahead, Zeke. Oh, I think you're taking the long way. Oh, maybe. You can step on that rock right there. Yeah, maybe. Sometimes you gotta test the rocks first because they'll, they'll dump. How about Daddy goes across first? Those are big steps. Are they slippery? Mine isn't waterproof. Mine either. Whoa, it's really yummy. No, now you have to carry one kid at a time over that. Yes, they're gonna they're gonna be soaked. Zeke, stop. I think we stop here and go through the green meadow. I think we're gonna stop here and go back the other way because I'm afraid we're gonna have lots and lots of wet kids if we try to cross this. Hallie does not care where she stops to play, even if we're by a pile of manure. Hallie, did you find another puddle to step in? Turn around, let me see your buns. What happened to you? What happened? I got in the puddle. We all dirty. Yeah. She splashed in the puddle and got all dirty. You wanna go play with Hannah and Zeke? Look what they found. <laughs> That's what happens when the puddle's bigger than you think. <laughs> we haven't been here for very long and we are already starting to go uphill. This is gonna be tough and encouraging kids. <laughs> oh, you're in the mud. Well, you're not as bad as Hallie. <laughs> Hallie, did you find more mud? <laughs> you baby girl. <laughs> Come on, Hallie, let's go. <laughs> Yeah, those boots are gonna be pretty well wet and ruined. Maybe not ruined, but dirty. I just washed those this last week too. Yeah. All right, come on, Hallie, let's go. Let's go. There you go. Let's go. Hallie, are you excited right now? Hey, Hallie is. What? I well, come on, Hallie. <laughs> Baby girl, you are so silly. Are you having fun? <laughs> <laughs> We're not gonna let you back in our car like that, Hallie. <laughs> yes, we will. I'm just kidding. All right, let's get, let's keep going, Hallie. Let's keep going. Uh, at this point, you might as well just let her go all in. <laughs> now for the big climb on up the hill. This is gonna be a killer. <sighs> Time for a break before we keep going up the hill. <sighs> that was rough. Hallie, I am so impressed with you. You know why? Because you're hiking all the way up this big hill all by yourself without even fussing. Uh -huh. You're a good hiker. 
Oh, and runner, you're gonna run up the hills? Man, Dan and I are like, <sighs> I mean, I got Toby on my back and Dana's pushing the twins. Even so, I'm impressed. I thought Hallie would be complaining and whining and I'd be holding her. Yeah, let's get a drink, we're almost at the top. Our car's parked up at the top of the hill. Was that a fun hike, everybody? Yeah. You guys have fun, get your shoes Hi, off, everybody. relaxing a little bit. Yeah, that was, a, that was good. The kids are in bed and now it's time for Dana and I to catch up a little bit. Yay. Well, there's some silence and quietness. Alone time. So what, <laughs> yeah, what did you think of that house? Is that gonna be for us? Uh, no. I don't think so either. The only thing I get, well, I liked, I really liked the kitchen. It was very pretty. I really liked the creek in the backyard. That was really cool. This is the first house that I've seen where the dining room would actually work for us. Right. Because it was attached to another room that you could overflow into. Right. No other dining room has had that capability. Look at the situation, guys. So here's our dining room. And right now, it's right there. But when we add the twins to it, I don't know how we're going to fit. Like, Toby doesn't even sit at the table with us right now. He sits kind of randomly off on his own. So I don't know how we're going to fit two more people. Like, like that kitchen is totally not going to work. So, and then we have guests. Um, we used to have them before we got pregnant with the twins every other week or so other families over for dinner but we like and to get we back have, that rhythm again we have fit an extra large family in there with us diagonally yeah diagonally but you can't move oh yeah yeah not so, in this kitchen i don't know what we're gonna do yeah so it was also a little bit um there's no place for me to work really so you guys saw all that but uh, well, so that house isn't gonna work for us yeah. we're gonna keep hunting keep looking uh, but i really like the idea of having a creek in the backyard now so Hopefully we can make that happen. <laughs> also, we would love to hear from you guys in the comments below about what other ideas you guys have for fun family adventure days for us to maybe do, because we end up doing a lot of hiking, which is fun, but we would like to hear some other creative ideas that you guys have that could work well, or maybe ones that you do with your family growing up, but that you're currently doing with your family. Give me your ideas down there. We'd love to hear all of them and uh, try some of them out. So thanks for hanging out with us, guys. Subscribe if this is your first time here. We're all about trying to become a family team, working together, growing connections and relationships with each other, and just really being like a unified a unified unit, which there I realize go. what I just said there, but you guys know what I'm saying. Uh, that's what we're all about. So subscribe to hang out with us as we learn to do that, and hopefully it helps you guys and your families as well. And we will see you guys on Wednesday. Actually, we'll see you tomorrow on Tuesday for a live hangout at 8 p.m. Eastern time here on our channel, but then we'll see you for our next vlog then on Tuesday. So, or Wednesday. 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 You guys know what I'm saying. It's tired. I'm, 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 <laughs> I'm late, it's tired. I'm tired, it's late, and we'll see you guys soon. <laughs> Bye. We're gonna go ahead and give this to you, and I just do a little bit, and um, so sometimes they're like, they're not sure if they like it or not. And it just tastes kind of funny to them.